This video features a preview from one of Texas Wildlife Association's on-demand youth webinars. Please enjoy the preview and look out for program details at the end. The stripes on a caterpillar's body are a warning sign alerting predators to stay away because they are poisonous. When a caterpillar is in its fifth phase or instar, it is ready to transform and change into the third stage of the life cycle. Do you know the third stage of the butterfly life cycle? The third stage of complete metamorphosis is scientifically known as the pupa. For butterflies, the third stage is also known as the chrysalis. The chrysalis is a hard shell that protects the soft body of the pupa as it is undergoing the transformation into an adult butterfly. Let's watch a video of a fifth instar caterpillar pupating or transforming into a chrysalis. The caterpillar will make a small dot on the underside of the leaf and attaches itself using small claspers at the end of its body. Next, it forms a J shape. This J shape is typical for monarchs when they are pupating. Next, the caterpillar will shed its skin for the final time. The hard shell, or chrysalis, is actually clear, and the green color comes from the pupa inside. Here is a newly formed chrysalis. See those gold dots? Scientists don't really know the purpose of the gold dots, but that is where the term chrysalis gets its name. Chrysalis means gold or gold colored in Greek. This picture shows the chrysalis getting darker. Look closely. You can see the pattern of the monarch's wings through the clear shell of the chrysalis. That is when we know the butterfly is ready to come out or eclose. Let's watch a video of the adult butterfly eclosing. When it's ready to eclose, the butterfly releases a puff of air to break the chrysalis shell, then it begins to emerge. The butterfly will attach its legs to the sticky outside of the chrysalis. At this time, the wings are very small and the abdomen is very large. The abdomen is full of a liquid called lymphatic fluid and the butterfly will pump this liquid into its wings. You can see the abdomen pumping if you look very closely. Once the fluid has been pumped into the wings, the butterfly will hang straight down, allowing its wings to dry. It can take from four to 12 hours for the butterfly's wings to completely dry. When the wings are dry, the butterfly will begin to open and shut its wings to strengthen its flying muscles.